I have bought some things. It's a Christmas decor haul! Yay! Hello, my little Christmas balls. Welcome back to the merriest place on the internet. This is my Christmas 2022 decor haul. Most of it is stuff to go on Christmas trees because that's just my MO trees. I have a few other things though, which is kind of exciting. I will link everything that I can below in case you see something you also have to have because I needed all these things. I needed all of them. Not one thing was a want, except the soap. You need soap, we need soap, you need soap. This will also kind of be a sneaky peeky of the trees I'm decorating this year because I had to buy things for two trees. So you'll get a nice little spoiler. If you're new here, hi, my name is Kim and I'm very merry. I am just a lady who loves Christmas trees and talking about Christmas. It's a safe place to talk about Christmas and Christmas trees all year long. Feel free to subscribe if you also love Christmas trees and decorating for Christmas. Let's get right into this haul because I'm very excited with all the things. I'm going to start with a new Christmas tree. I bought a new Christmas tree for this year. I am very excited for it. I did an unboxing video here. You can watch, it's ridiculous. It is a seven and a half foot pre-lit LED flocked tree from Home Depot. I always wanna say Lowe's, but I got it from Home Depot. I'm 90% sure. No, I did, I did. It's gorgeous, it's fun, it's, I, I just love it. I've already decorated it and everything, but yeah, you can see a picture of it. That was a good purchase. It's, I'm looking at it right now and good job, Kim. That was a self high five. I also ordered myself a second appliance dolly. Stay with me for a second. I call these my tree dollies. It's a platform that I put my trees on so I can wheel them around because I move them around more than a person would normally move a Christmas tree. Tree dolly slash appliance dolly is from Amazon. It's very decently priced. Can actually, like it's actually meant to be moving like washers and dryers and things. And so it's got a good like weight capacity on it. That one's kind of a weird one that maybe not something everybody needs, but I love having it so that I don't have to try to drag a fully decorated or fully set up tree, scratching my floors, whatever. I don't have to try to shimmy, it just moves. It just wheels right where I need it. If you do find yourself being like, man, I kinda wanna move my tree, but I don't wanna take all the decorations and everything off of it, might I suggest an appliance dolly. Let's stick with the Amazon theme. I think I already mentioned that I'll have links below. Everything for Amazon will be an affiliate link, just so you know that. I got this green velvet ribbon. I think we're at two inches. Doesn't even say on the thing, this is so made in China. I just didn't have the budget for nicer ribbon because I bought so much this year. Uh, so I had to Amazon my ribbon. This looks really pretty. It's gonna go great on the tree. It's a bit of a crushed velvet situation, shiny reflective on the other side, which would actually also look super great on a tree if you wanted a more reflective situation. We're gonna call this double-sided and that, you know, I'm a genius. Really excited for this. I also got oh, crinkly plastic, black poinsettia, peria, la, la, la. black poinsettia flower blossoms. So they have like the, so you can stick a stem in them if you have them. I don't need stems. A little bit of glitter in there, uh, very small, not very small, small-ish. I have small hands though, so most people would be like, ah! <laughs> I have tiny little fairy hands. I can't remember how many is in the pack, but oh, that plastic crinkly sound. These are going on the same tree. It's only gonna get better. I also got these little black spiral strip ornaments. They're also black and they are reflective and like, oh, love that. There's 24 in here, so I got bunches and bunches and bunches and bunches of them. I love having icicle-like things to take really vertically on the tree and these are gonna, these are gonna really like check that box for me and I'm, I'm really excited. This is gonna be another like tree reveal, but from Amazon, this box of light lavender dusty purple Christmas balls. Purple balls. I ordered this same set in green last year and they are amazingly cheap in terms of quality. You can see the seam. You can see the seam 
of like paint line or plastic seam from the mold on the Christmas ball. But when they're hanging on your tree, you're not gonna see that unless you're looking for it. And now you're probably gonna be looking for it because I showed you that in these videos. But the thing is, I needed a lot of purple ornaments and I didn't have a lot of money. So this works. I just take the hit with quality. Plastic, so they're shatterproof, which I have to have. When they're on the tree, they look they look fine. They look perfectly fine. They also work really, really well in ornament clusters. And so I'm excited for these. I'm just excited because we're doing a purple tree. And that is, I was really angry in my Christmas trends video where pink is so huge this year because I really wanted purple to have a moment. We've done pink a couple years ago, pink was huge. A couple years before that, pink was huge. Pink is super huge this year. And I just wanted purple to be the pastel color of the year. We're gonna trend set and make purple happen. People are gonna see my tree and they're gonna fall in love with my tree. And then everybody's gonna want a purple tree next year and I'm gonna be going, ha, purple. That's my evil plan. Also from Amazon, got these for the purple tree. Purple leaf picks. Can you see how glittery they are? Shiny. I think it's an order of 10, really inexpensive. They're not crazy long, the pick part on it, but we're gonna make it work. They're gonna stick out of the tree and be really lovely. I also got this purple ribbon. That's a terrible sound. The purple ribbon was not easy to find. I had to venture outside of the Christmas stuff. That's a tip. Let me tell you, because another ribbon I got that I'll show you in a second from the craft store, I got outside the Christmas section. And this one I got outside the Christmas section. It's by Pure Color More and More Decorative Ribbon. It's not meant to be Christmas tree ribbon or Christmas wrap ribbon or whatever. It's just ribbon for floral bouquets, weddings, what have you, whatever you need ribbon for. Sometimes because it's Christmas ribbon, they uh, up the price a little bit. If you can venture outside the Christmas section for the color you need, you might be able to find it a little less expensive. You're not gonna find candy cane peppermint ribbon, but red, green, blue, purple. If you just need a regular color ribbon, not so much your textures and patterns, but for just a solid color, venture outside the Christmas decor section. You'll be surprised what you can find. So this is a sheer, very light purple, lilac-y kind of color, shiny sheer, super pretty, wired because I'll die if it's not a wired ribbon. It's gonna be really pretty. The last thing from Amazon is also for the purple tree and it's these cute, statement Christmas baubles. There's eight in here, two different designs, this swirling pearl thing and this very textured sequence and pearl situation. These are gonna look really great just as an extra little statement piece so it's not all florals and balls. I mean, these are balls, but they're pretty balls. Gorgeous balls. I need to make a video at the end of the year of just me saying balls over and over again. I just loved how pretty these are and they kind of, even though the texture is a rough texture on these, the white adds a softness to it and I really want it to be a soft tree, if that makes sense. I thought these would be the perfect addition and kind of finishing touch to that tree. I did get one thing from Michael's craft store and it is this wired ribbon. Look how giant she is. Do we see the difference here? Huge. This is one that I got in the regular ribbon section at Michael's. They had one that was really similar in the Christmas section that wasn't quite as sheer. It was a little thicker, more opaque. I mean, it was double the price and not quite as much yardage, if I want to remember right. This was months ago, so I can't remember. This was in the regular ribbon section. It was bright Christmas red that I needed. And it was, I mean, it's how long are you? Nine, 10, 10 yards. 10 yards of ribbon, which is great. And it was cheaper than the Christmas ribbon and almost the same thing. So like I said, yeah, but it's really pretty. I just needed some classic red. I meant to buy red ribbon last year and bought maroon ribbon and was really excited until I realized, hey, dum-dum, you don't have red ribbon. And I wanna use this on a wreath, I think. So it's really pretty and classic. Okay, let's talk about at home. At home, home decor, superstore, now does online shopping. They started it last year, but I didn't order anything because by the time I learned that they did online shopping, I was already done. I will say that it wasn't as fun to shop online and at home as it is to just walk around that beautiful, fun store. Know that, but it shipped in a timely manner. They do charge for shipping. There's no free shipping option, which was kind of sucky, but the nearest at-home decor superstore to me is two hours away. 
So with these gas prices and this economy, it made much more sense to just pay the 10 bucks for shipping. <laughs> okay. First off, I got more balls, green balls, which is kind of funny because I bought green balls last year. But these are darker emerald green balls, not lighter peridot green balls. So here we go. 16 shatterproof green Christmas balls. A little dented, a little bit sucks. I'm not that mad for the price of these. I mean, geez, come on. Four different finishes on them. We have reflect glitter matte and oh, just kidding. Three different finishes <laughs> reflecting glitter and matte. And so there's um, eight reflect and of uh, the reflecting ones and then four of the other ones. So this would be a nice variety in the same color family. Also ordered one size bigger. So these six Christmas balls in a size bigger so that we essentially have two different sizes happening here, which is what I, well, we have three different sizes, but we'll get to that in a second. Six pieces of just the bigger Christmas ball in the finishes from before. Gorgeous, and they're just gonna add a little more dimension, which I love. Speaking of giant balls, I got four Christmas balls the size of my head. I'm so excited. I started it at home looking for big, really fill in a lot of space Christmas balls. I just went looking for really big balls. I gotta stop. And I saw these and my brain doesn't really like to comprehend measurements. Like I'm like seven inches, that's bigger than these, but not by too much. Like that will be just a little bigger than those. I'm thinking seven to eight inches is like this. It's actually this. Freak out, not a freak out. I just was shocked at my own me-ness. I have four, four of these bad boys. They're down here, I'm not gonna lift all of them up, but I have four. It's gonna look so friggin' cool. And that is everything I got from at home. Let's move on to Dollar Tree. Got a few things. I went through their regular floral section and found these. I knew I wasn't gonna find a Christmas purple floral, but I needed some, few more purple flowers to just fill in for that purple tree and I got these. I may not even end up using these. Um, that tree is kind of my work of art, art piece tree this year where I kind of just let the design go where it's gonna go. I don't have a perfect picture in my head the way I do the green and black tree. Five of these florals that I can shove in if I need extra pops of purple. Again, venture out of the Christmas section if you're looking for something in a very specific color, but doesn't have to be actually like a poinsettia, like you can put regular flowers in a tree too. And I got some ribbons from Dollar Tree. Love getting ribbon from Dollar Tree. I got this green mesh ribbon. So I'll have three ribbons on the black and green tree. This is like a mesh situation, which is, a super fun texture. Um, that tree's like gonna be fun but elegant. It's gonna be like fancy fun. Still fun, but also fancy. The thing with Dollar Tree ribbon is they, they don't put a lot on the spool. It says nine feet, right? Most ribbons are measured by yards. So you see, you see nine feet and you think, oh cool, like nine yards of ribbon. That's, it's not, it's nine feet, which is three yards. Math, it's not a lot once you start looping and bowing and adding things. So I got three spools of that so I wouldn't run out. And I also got three spools of gold because my gold ribbon is sad. So I need a new gold ribbon texture. So I got three of these because again, I needed enough yardage for some stuff. That is all the tree stuff that I got this year. It seems like not that much, um, but the pile is very large. I also got a new tree and a new dolly. So like it adds up. A few things that I got just from my home. I don't buy a lot of home decor outside of Christmas tree stuff. All of my shelf stuff is nostalgic and is the same every year and it's very, very specific. It works for me. I did, however, buy Christmas soap. I love smelling Christmas smellies and smellies and Christmas that are smellies. So I ordered the Blue Land foaming hand soap tablets in their Christmas scents. Blue Land, if you don't know, is a low waste cleaning supply company. You just get the tab and you drop it in the bottle full of water and you have bathroom cleaner, multi-surface cleaner, window cleaner and that stuff. And they also have foaming hand soap. And I love their foaming hand soap. They have Christmas scents. And I love them because these packages are compostable. They come in recyclable boxes when they're shipped. It's just a lower waste option and all these things, which I love. I know it doesn't seem like it because I 
do nothing but buy piles of plastic at Christmas time. To offset that, I try to cut my waist in literally every other aspect of my life. This is a way that I can do that and I really love that. I have the scent Evergreen, Winterberry, and Peppermint. They smell great, the soaps work great. I'm really excited to have all these. Smelly Christmas hand soap. And lastly, I bought Christmas art supplies. Here's the thing. I have been getting into collage art recently. Great, great stress reliever for me. So I bought a bunch of scrap paper. These are all different varieties. There's like all kinds of different different kinds in here. There's a bunch of different ones. And this smaller one here that has a variety, I think they're also double-sided, of just different Christmas patterns normally for scrapbooking that I'll be using for a collage art thing that I like to do. These are both from Amazon. You can also get um, similar ones at a craft store anywhere. So I also got some canvases. These are from Walmart, actually. I think they are from Walmart. Just two uh, set up canvases already so that I can have some that are just ready to go if I want to. Because I think I'm going to gift some to some people this year. Uh, this way I don't have to... I can just put it right on the thing and it's good to go. Two of those so I can experiment with it. Just some canvases to make some Christmas art because I'm legitimately going to make some Christmas art this year. I might show it to you. Let me know if you want to see that. I don't know if you care. You're like, shut up, trees only which is, I'm fine with that. That is everything I got for the Christmas 2022 season. To see my new Christmas tree and me unboxing it, it was an adventure. You can click or tap right up here. And for some Christmas tree tips and Christmas tree designs, you can click or tap right down here. Thank you so much for watching. I really love you. And until we meet again, sparkle on.